Hi, I'm Michelle, and today we're going to be talking about weighing animals and calculating an average daily rate of gain. So why do we weigh animals? There are three different reasons on this ranch that we weigh animals. One is we go to shows, especially 4-H shows, our animals have to be a specific weight or within a specific weight range in order to enter a specific class in a specific show. So we need to know exactly how much our animal weighs so we know how to enter them in a show. Another reason that we need to weigh our animals is so that we can medicate appropriately. Sometimes various medications will say, give this amount per 22 pounds of animal weight. If you have no idea what your animal weighs, there's no way you can dose or administer medication in a proper way. The last reason that we like to weigh our animals is we want to keep tabs on just their overall health. If an animal weighs a certain amount one day and then three months later weighs a significantly less or more, we need to adjust how much we're feeding, the animal's exercise program perhaps, um, or we just need to be aware of the fact that that animal could either be sick or um, just experiencing some other problem that the vet needs to come out and help us deal with in order to make sure that all of our animals are staying as healthy as possible. On this ranch, there are three ways that we like to weigh our animals. The first, um, which is the most cost effective, easiest method to get a hold of is called a weight tape. So you can actually get something that looks like a tape measure and you can use that around your animal to get a rough estimate. Um, sometimes it's pretty good, sometimes it's not as accurate, but you can get a rough estimate as to what your animal weighs. The second way that we like to weigh our animals is with a small animal livestock scale. Our small animal livestock scale weighs animals from zero to 400 pounds. So that's one of our scales. And then we also have a large animal scale and that one weighs animals that go up to 12,000 pounds. So we're gonna go ahead and take you on a little tour of our ranch and show you those methods for weighing our animals. So this is our weight tape. It has two sides on it. One side we use to measure how tall the horses are and the other side we use to measure how much they weigh. So we'll go ahead and start to get the most accurate answer. We're gonna try and get them standing nice and square with their head held a little bit higher. We're gonna go ahead and send it over the top and then reach underneath them and grab it. So it's wrapping all the way around their heart girth. We're then gonna pull this up and we want it to be nice and snug and we're gonna see where the end of the tape matches the numbers. So she's measuring at about 505 pounds. I'm here at our small animal livestock scale. This is a digital model. So we have our digital reader up here. It's very important before we weigh our animals, we turn it on and we zero the scale out so that it doesn't mess with the weight. And then we put the animal on the scale. Once he stops moving, we look at the reader and we can see that he weighs 16.8 pounds. And then you can just take your animal off when you're done. This is our weight balanced large livestock scale. Uh, the first thing you want to do before using it is balance it out. So make sure that the floor of the scale is clean, the doors are closed, and then we'll go ahead and level it out. So make sure these are both at zero. All right, I'm going to lift this lever up and that's how we know where it's balanced. That should be hovering right in the middle of these two points. We're hovering a little bit low right now so I'm gonna move this cylinder back a little bit just by threading it um, towards the rear. All right, we're balanced dead center. All right, so next thing is just lock this down so it doesn't jolt up um, and move anything. All we have to do is open up the door, put the animal in, close the door, and then we'll, we'll see how much it weighs. So now that Fiona's in there, the gates are closed, we're gonna go ahead and start measuring. Um, so I'm just going to give a rough estimate. I'm just going to estimate she's about 550 pounds. All right, so I'm going to move this bottom cylinder to 500 pounds and the top one to 50 pounds. We're bobbing a little bit. She weighs more than 550 pounds, so I'm going to go up to 600. 600, we hit bottom. So I'm going to go five, 575. Five 
575 is a little bit, a little bit heavy. So we'll do five sixty. Uh, about five sixty-five. So this says five hundred and sixty-five seventy pounds. So the measuring tape we taped her and she was five hundred and five pounds. And this says she's five hundred and sixty-five to seventy pounds. Um, so that weight tape does generally um, work and it was about 50 pounds off, which is not much. Uh, it was in the same ballpark, which is great, but this will give you an exact amount. Um, and that's, that's how you operate this weight balanced scale. Let's talk about daily rate of gain or average daily gain. Once you know what your animal weighs, we use something called a tack room weight sheet. And basically that's where we keep it in our tack room. It's a piece of paper and every week, every seven days, sometimes every 15 days, sometimes every 30 days, depending on the species of the animal or which animal it is, um, we will write down what day it is. So usually I do the date, not necessarily day one to day seven, but I'll do the date and then I can calculate how many days that was by just using the date. Then we write down exactly what the animal weighs on that date. So this is just an example of one of our hogs. So I will definitely write down what species of animal it is. This is a hog. On the day, first day that we weighed, it weighed 200 pounds. Seven days later, we came back and it weighed 221 pounds. What we can do with that information is figure out how many pounds per day that animal is gaining. And that can be really, really helpful um, in a show situation, especially if you're raising animals for 4-H um, or other um, kids' livestock shows. We wanna know what our animal weighs today and what it's gonna weigh in two months so that we don't go over that weight and we'll know how to enter that animal into a show. So what we do is we take 21 pounds, so from 200 pounds to 221, that pig gained 21 pounds in seven days. I'll divide seven into 21 and that gives me three. So I know that this hog in seven days time gained three pounds every day. So that's one of our simple um, conversions that we use and ways that we calculate how much gain our animals are getting every single day or over the course of a week or two weeks or a month. And it's just really helpful information. Thank you so much for watching our video today on how we weigh our animals and how we calculate an average daily rate of gain. Well, I hope that you really enjoyed the content. Please like and subscribe to our channel. Please leave me any comments or questions that you might have in the comments below.